We can do this later. We can do this later. It's all good. It's all good, Ray. So who oh, the fuck 20. are we slaughtering? A lot has a lot has happened. Like a lot has happened. What's going on? Well, first of all, you know Denzel. Yeah, I know Denzel. Our family, the mayor. Yeah, of course. You never forget Denzel. A stupid motherfucker. Oh no. Shot the fucking deputy mayor. Wait, he shot who? Bassam. Wait, he shot Bassam? Yeah, so. But he's not dead, right? I see you probably. No, Bassam's dead. What? Yep. So unfortunately, Denzel is a. Uh, Essentially being investigated right now for murder. Oh my wow. god. No way. It gets a little bit deeper than this. Hey, you're joking, right? No, Why the I'm fuck would joking. Denzel kill Bassam? Okay, let me so rephrase that. Why would Denzel not kill anyone? Right. Well, so what the fuck would, happened? Like, someone to take care of it for him, right? Like a smart right. man would do in his situation or in his essentially his place. Right. Well, that's what a smart man would do. Don't forget that. Denzel's a smart guy, but he's got a short tempered. You know what I mean? There's nothing wrong with that. Now let's talk about the man. Well, let's say, okay. This is the way that Buddha would describe it. You watch porn. Yeah, I watch porn. Amateur. Uh, sometimes like the not so amateur, you know, like where the, where the fucking, you know, the babysitter hey, walks like in and she's like, oh. Oh, hey there, you know? Yes. And then, like, also, no. like, where, you know, like, the fucking stepmom, she's like, Yeah, yeah exactly. Oh, hey there. <laughs> yeah, your you father's like out of sis. town. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you don't like stepmom. You know what I mean? Like oh, wow, your like... cock's so much bigger than your father. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Well, no, I mean, I don't watch that thing. But, hey, anyway, uh, like, right. yeah, yes. Anyway, yeah, you get that. Like, the stepsis is stuck in the drawer of the laundry right. thing, right? of course. And you would do anything to help her, right? Because right. that's the man you are Right. I need a now, let me say that, right. uh, you know, Denzel's wife, you know, he's married. He is, right? Yeah, he's married to Andy. Wait, he's married to Andy? Yeah. Now, like, I didn't know that. Your wife, that, right. uh, you know, sexy ass babe stuck in the laundry mat, is it, you know, teasing you, asking you for help. Right. Fucking ass bent over, panties down. Exactly. Yeah. And a man would do anything. Right. And he did. Oh, fuck. Wait, so he fucked so, his wife while killing Bassam? No, but let's just say that Andy kind of manipulated, you know, Denzel oh, to shame. Kill, like, uh, Bassam because it had something to do with Andy and Bassam. There was drama. It was the stupidest fucking thing you will ever hear. Wait, You're so like, Andy wanted him dead and Denzel killed him? Yeah, but there's more to it than that. So... Let's explain it from the start. Right. Bjorn is with Andy. And okay. Bassam did something like insulted Andy. I don't remember what it was. Something along the lines of calling her like, I don't know, psychopathic or uh, some shit like that. I don't know uh, the, the, the beginning of that story. But let's just say that Bjorn was with Andy. Right. They kidnapped Bassam. They ripped all of his, you know, nails out, interrogated him, tortured him, did everything to him. Why? And you know what these motherfuckers do? Well, you listen Damn. to the worst part. Okay. okay. After they, they interrogated him, ripped his nails out. Did all this crazy shit to him. Right. They're like, you know what's a good idea we should do now? We should get our car repaired with the fucking, you know, person we just interrogated in the trunk. Oh so they God. take Bassam, someone who has a close tie to autos. Oh, my God. To autos, autos, where all the mechanics are. Why around. is my son so stupid? Yeah. Oh, God. You don't even know. You don't know. Oh, about Bjorn, do you? Oh, no. Bjorn's in for oh. the nines. What? My son? the nines oh no oh my fucking game they think he did it didn't they 
They think yeah, he didn't, so, didn't they? Well, he was part of it, actually. Oh, He's, my he, fucking guy. Bjorn was one of the individuals with Andy that interrogated Sasha. Hold on. The, no, 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 no. Don't call anyone yet. Don't call anyone yet. Listen, Tony. Wait. This goes into some deep shit. Wait, my son texted me. What did he text? You saying? Oh, fuck. <laughs> He's next to the lean boy sign. <laughs> And By the way, Tony, you might be investigated. Don't text anyone. Wow, that's a little too late. Whatever you do, do not text anyone. I said, anyone. son, what the fuck? LOL, my boy. <laughs> but it was just a picture of him next to the Lean Boys poster in jail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That can mean fine. anything. Listen. So let me describe some shit. So it goes really, really deep. Okay. After they interrogated him, they took him to the autos. They're like, how deep are we talking? Like, It involves everyone. Now, let's, oh, let's continue really quick. So, as, as quick right. as we can. Auto, at Autos, they they obviously have him. They Everyone sees Bjorn and Andy with Bash him, him as, the, right. as the last people seen with him. So, guess who the primary suspects are right now? They Andy, are, and, are, uh, Andy, Andy and Andy Bjorn. and Bjorn. All right. That's what you think, all right? So, but obviously, it wasn't them that killed Bass and it was right. Joe. Oh, by the way, no one knows about that yet. Stands up. It's only us. But Wait, so why is my son in jail? Oh, nobody knows that Denzel was the one who killed him. Yeah, everyone kind of knows about... It's somewhat public knowledge about Bjorn and, and Andy, but they don't know their involvement yet. So I'm just trying my best. So, so was there the a murder weapon there's, found? There's so much... No, the murder weapon was AK-47. Then the glove doesn't fit. I'll tell you what, my son will have the best fucking court case. I will make sure to get my son the best fucking lawyer, okay? My, my son, the best fucking lawyer. Was the body found in the car? So he was not dead at that point. He's still alive. Exactly. Exactly. At that point, at that point, at that point, I tell you where we're at. My son is not a murderer. He's an assistant right. murderer. And Let's at that continue. point, it's a lot less. You know what I mean? Let's let's continue though. Right. There's a lot of details to the story and it's right. gonna be like really jumbled. So I'm gonna try right. my best to explain as much as I can. Uh they get over to the pier. Denzel comes in at that situation. He doesn't I don't think he knew about the you know, autos auto <laughs> before then or any of the Fucking the, Tony knows how, how to make everything so much voice. funnier, dude. He's a K forty seven, shoots Bassum in the head. Wait, he shot yeah. Bassum in the head with an AK forty seven? Yes, off the pier. Oh my god. Wait, the Dean's World P? No, a different one. That, or, oh, yeah, probably Chumash. So here's the problem. Right. A bunch of people were subunits. So, like, their texts were taken. They were investigated. Their phones were investigated. Oh, this God. includes Glorion, Bjorn, oh, Andy, no. and five other people. Oh, fine. Uh, they took in Nino yesterday. They took in Dean. They took Wait, in Nino? Oh, oh, fine. Wait, Dean? So, Dean, I don't think, was fully taken in, but they, they're, his involvement is kind of concluded in this. It's so the service. <laughs> Which is you know, obviously Lang oh, and fuck. Lang oh, and Leslie and Dean. So damn. So damn. Okay. Speculation around the fact that they're involved. Oh, yesterday, Nino was being called up to uh, be subpoenaed, right, and uh, be put into jail for the ninth. N Wait, Nino? Yes. Nino's involvement was close too. Uh, upon meeting up with Kyle, we assumed there was going to be a lot of police officers there. So obviously, Nino was like, hey, great. They're going to arrest me here. Come through. Shoot any cops if I'm in handcuffs. So you know me. I bring an entire squad of gunners. <laughs> and uh, it was unfortunately only Kyle Pred. And I couldn't see uh, Nino in the handcuffs. So I actually ended up shooting Kyle right in the head. Oh my god. With an AK 47. Oh my god. Yeah. Uh, I think Nino was taken into questioning, but I think. Uh, he might be the primary suspect at the time. Bjorn just got taken in today for uh, the nines and is being questioned. And I think Andy is under uh, close investigation as well right now. So this is all Andy's fault. It's all Andy's fault. Yeah, that bitch is crazy. Man, you know what they say, brother. You know the worst. You know. You know what is. they say. You know what they say. You know what they say, motherfucker. You know what they say. I know what they say. Man. You know what they say, bro. I know what they say. You know bro. what they say. You know what they I don't even have to say it, but you know, you know what they say. You know what they say. 
I, I forget what they sang, but you know what they sang. They, they say it. I feel like it's it something from Skyface. I forget what it is. So here's the biggest problem. What, the, what is that? What's that saying? Hold on. They say a saying. They say a saying. It's a saying, and I feel like it's from Skyface. Just don't remember what it is. I don't remember what it is. I don't remember what it is. I could have swore I remember what it was, but I don't remember what it is. Listen, motherfucker. This is the important part. All right, go ahead. Basim, his nephew, or sorry, he's the nephew of Salim. Right. Salim is very, very fucking angry about what happened. And today we had a meeting with Salim, Peanut, and other NBC members with me, Dean, Lang, and Harry. And let's just say that as far as we're concerned, NBC was very, very very intimate on the threatening bank or bank blank right so uh they threatened us they essentially said they were coming for bjorn we're coming for the nerds uh watch right. your establishment you know, that's everything. that's the cute thing you know what i mean it's like here's the funny thing right you have a group that talks so much shame but then what they're gonna do is is they're gonna go after the weakest links people that they know they can easily defeat right just to show like they're you know they they uh they have some type of some type of pull, you know what I mean? Imagine yeah. wanting to go to war, essentially, and then saying I'm gonna attack your weakest members. I'm gonna pussy shit his ain't. You know well, what I listen, mean? Tony, you know how strong a chain <laughs> is? It's dependent on its weakest link, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, but like imagine so like Yeah, but like but like apparently. imagine, you know what I mean? No, I do, I understand, but it's, it's the Like aren't you supposed to go in do? there like I'm gonna fucking kill you? No, you I, know what I mean, the, but the coward thing to do, but it's also. So he said he's you know, not gonna attack us. He's gonna attack our friends, essentially. They're gonna attack everyone, but Link right. called them back and it's was cute. like, "Hey, right." Uh, so we were very hesitant about telling information because no one in the city knows anything yet. So Lang called them back and said, "Hey, Andy," right. essentially, kind of you know, like insinuated it, didn't directly say it because the call might be tapped. We don't know if the right. NBC is working with the police yet. Right. He, he said that Andy was the one who interrogated. Right. And killed Bassam. Right. Obviously, it's not fully truthful, but that's what he said. Right. Wait, so... So, basically, NBC wants to go to war with the ice because Denzel killed Bat. Do they know that Denzel killed Bassam? No one knows. It's me. So, why do they want to go to war? Like Wait, so hey, they... By the way... How do they know? Not, even, not everyone in the family knows right. that yet. Just yeah, but me, so, me, how do they know me, that... You know. We had him killed, essentially. What do you mean? So, like, what led to the conversation of, like, them wanting to attack us? Bjorn's involvement. Right, right, right. Because of the nerds. They, they're targeting the nerds. Right, right, right. Right. What do you think they gain from this? Revenge. Right, right. Right. What else? Well, I don't know. I don't know how much everyone knows at this point. I was one of the people who was there at the start uh, since yesterday. Uh, Ling and everyone got told today because they weren't around yesterday. Right. But I hope everyone's doing well in the knowledge. It was me, mostly Nino, yesterday. Have you shot um, them yet? Have I shot them? No, we yeah. haven't been involved in any Have they shot yet. us yet? Nope, not yet. So is it a war or is it not a war? We don't know yet. Do you think they're going to go to war with us? Because here's the thing, right? Is that a good friend of mine is the city's, you know, weapon connect, right? So, like, if I wanted to, I could just call my sister now and just stop giving them guns. Yeah. We don't know yet. We don't know the ramifications of the situation. We don't know anything that's going on as of yet. We 
are going to figure it out. So what Lang did is essentially buy his time for the statement right. about Mayor Andy. Or sorry, ex Mayor Andy. We don't know what that's gonna what what their next move is going to be. See, they could also be empty threats. We also speculated on the fact that they might be working with the police because they called us. Or right. Right. They could be tapped. They could be wired. So essentially, right. I mean, the, there's probably little details that I'm missing here in the end, but the main goal is Denzel killed somebody. NBC wants war. Denzel killed somebody. Right. They don't know that Mayor Denzel Andy's. killed somebody, but they Sorry. know somebody's dead. The last person spotted was my Bjorn son and Andy. Andy. They think it Bjorn fucking killed him. So yes. they're like, hey, we want to go to war so that way we can get revenge. Uh, revenge. And we're like, oh, okay, fine. That's cool. Yeah. And then that's basically it. And then everybody. What, so what happened with Nino? Let me hear that a little bit. Why is Nino all cut all that? You know what I mean? What's wrong with Nino? What's happening with him? Well, Nino was kind of obviously, you know, we're all family. We were there for it. Nino right. was uh, being investigated by Kyle Pred and a bunch of other individuals. We were, right. uh, well, besides myself, actually, I wasn't being investigated, gladly. I, I was one of the individuals who avoided being subpoenaed and involved directly in the investigation. But Nino was unfortunately one of the people who was directly in the middle of it. Um, all I did was shoot Kyle Pred straight in the head and be a part of all the other conversations. But I, I messed up. Air One was looking for us all day yesterday, and they were they were essentially wanting to get everyone in custody for questioning. Yo, what's up, chat? Good to see you guys. See, the police didn't have any. I can love you guys. Like, Thank I you guys for coming out tonight. Yesterday or the day before yesterday. Right. Yeah. Because I think the killing happened on Saturday. Buddha probably knows a lot more. That not saying that you're not saying anything, because obviously you are. But because this yeah, is the yeah. time you wake up around, you probably. Don't you know. The yeah, oh, you don't know really like all the beginning stuff, right? So I can't expect you to tell me everything or you know yeah, of course. stuff but like you that. Also right? assume something else yeah, I could definitely it could, of weekend, course. You know yeah, what I mean? Of course, of course. I guess yeah. the main concern is like who do I need to be looking over my shoulder for right now? It's not about what happened well let's when it happened, miss, what I, I need to be looking out I for. Yeah, go ahead. Miss, I haven't missed very many details except the Drea thing. Drea, what happened with Drea? Drea the same night ended up getting shot. And I believe she was probably ocean dumped. She forgot everything essentially that happened the night. My who? We don't know, but we're assuming it's a man named Doodle or some sort of ever down. Doodle Bob? No, no, no. Not Doodle Bob. But you know Doodle Bob, right? No, I don't know this. Hold on. You don't know who Doodle Bob is? Danny Doodle. But his name is like Danny something else. He worked for the art on... Uh, but you know, that's like, Doodle, that, that's like Doodle Bob's thing, though. You know that, right? Oh, oh, I'm annoying. Sure. You know what I mean? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. You know who I'm talking about, right? Yeah, from SpongeBob. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> listen, they, it's his, he's actually someone who's done artwork for, oh, I'm for uh, <laughs> the Rooster Rest before. The Rooster right. Reef or some shit like that. It's the same guy that Lang cut the finger off of. And then during the Denzel Mayor thing. Damn, so this is like thing, his Joker revenge. Yeah, during the Denzel Mayor thing, he made an entire video mocking Denzel about how he'd be a bad... Uh, I don't know if you remember this. A bad mayor and everything. Damn. So we need... The Wait, Buddha cut his finger like, off? Yeah. Wow. Jesus Christ. Yeah, there's a lot of details to the entire story. For the most part, I caught you up on, I think, everything that's important. Uh, everything else involved is just most people are staying low. So who do I got to be? Should I be looking out for the cops? Should I be looking out for NBC? You want to go hop in the Audi R8 and shoot these motherfuckers? No, like, no, no, no. We've been chilling. Everyone's been laying low. Well, like, here's my thing, right? right? Here's my thing, right? It's like... I don't know. I'm not going to say it. Never mind. Yeah, it's all good, man. We'll figure it out. For the most part, it's all uh, empty threats currently. And we're right. chilling tonight. Actually, right. I'm just doing some boosting tonight. If you wanna, I actually want to do some A's and hang out. Bro, I am so down to boost. Yeah. So down to boost. So if we see them tonight, you want to shoot them or what? No. We're avoiding conflict at the current moment. Sir. Okay. Staying low. So what Where if they start hate? talking shit? You know what I mean? The friends of ours. Or for, for right. the most part, the friends of ours. Why? 
Tony, I like being the person who reciprocates rather than being the first person to shoot. I think it's always an easier side to defend. You know what I mean? Right. Even in war. Right. Like in Japan, the United States, you know what I mean? Right. Pearl Harbor. You get attacked, then you can reciprocate. You can uh, retaliate. And but I'll be honest, attacks. I don't really know history too well. That's fine. I'm going to know about Pearl Harbor and all that stuff. Listen, I'm just kind of a fucking idiot. I boost cars, I race, and I fucking rob banks, to be honest. Um, yeah. So. <laughs> Look, brother, let's fucking... So here's my thing, right? Hey, what's up? I'm just going to say it as best as it can be said. So, like... Hypothetically, theoretically, quadmatratically speaking... What do you think revenge means from them? Do you think that here's, means... Here's my honest opinion. One shot to the before. hospital. Okay, that's our revenge. Do you think that's... We're gonna hang you every single day. That's our revenge. Bro, listen to you this. You know what I mean? If they were going to have done something... Right. They would have done something by now. I think it was an idle threat, and I think there was a wiretap involved. That's what my personal opinion is. I don't know what Lang thinks at this point in forward time, but it was so weird the way they were acting. Uh, you know, okay. You know me. During the meeting... They're having the conversation. You know what right. I was doing? I was looking everywhere around us. I was looking on the roof. So we were at the parking garage on the, uh, by the, fuck, what do you even describe that? By Great Ocean Highway. Right. And I kept looking up at the roof. I kept looking up around all of us. You know, if I were the individuals that invited a group of people to a spot for a meeting, I would keep someone on the roof with a gun. I would keep someone hidden. I would keep someone somewhere else. There was only three of them. So there was only three of them at this point. Yeah, so I was sitting there, like, looking around everywhere. Like, where the fuck is the fourth guy? Where the fuck is he? Where is he on the roof? Is he... Bro, they didn't have anyone. Did you ask them? No. I just thought it was weird. And then um, the conversation, right. when they called us, I was like, why would they have called us and not said it at the meeting? Anyway, it could be speculation. Kind of weird. It could be crazy. Um, I, don't think, I don't think you're crazy. I think, I think you got damn right. Could have been a wiretap. You know what I mean? Could have been anything, to be honest. Because there's a huge police investigation exactly. going on. And they guess who they probably contacted in regards to this? Right. The guy's, the guy's uh, uncle. Right. The way I look at it is like, if we're going to go to war, then I guess we're going to war, right? But like, nothing I can do about it. Rather than just get my gun and put somebody so down, I guess, you're... right? I mean, family's family. You defend them with your lives. That's Especially right. Especially the weak links. You know what I mean? Hey, That's anyway, right. come with me for a second. I need to ask a question. Okay. Have you ever run weed before? Nope. Oh, Buddha and Harry, yeah. So, unfortunately, or fortunately, you know, uh, many weeks ago, remember we did a huge transportation of weed out of here? Right. Well, I'm pretty sure Lang and everyone forgot about that because we was sitting at Yuno's house. Oh, We ended fuck. up going to Dre's home and we emptied the entire house and it was full of weed. <laughs> But it's about to be expired. So I was going to ask you, do you want to just run that tonight? Uh, or uh -oh. should we just let it expire? Um, Come in here. I think you got to build your rep amp. What do you mean build your rep? I always hear Buddha and Harry talking about like rep and stuff. You know what I mean? Like oh, they always like a rep system. Kind of yeah, like they like else? note down the prices and shit. You know what I mean? God if damn, where the, the fuck all the guns go? I'm well, all I know is I've taken, I've taken one gun and I've paid you for it. Like, nah, I don't give a fuck, boys. You guys can do whatever, man. I have fucking, I put in money for the boys. You guys do shit for me. It is what it is. I can hang out with this shit. You know what I mean? We kill it, boys. So you see near the bottom, it's all like four packages of 200, or, yeah, 200 grams. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, bro. All this shit will be good at the bottom here. Yeah, Buddha and no, Harry no. can run this in the morning. Bit more up. Oh, fuck. This shit. Oh, fuck. I'll be honest, I don't really feel comfortable running this. Because I don't really know how it works. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean... Want to see something crazy? If you want to do it, we could do it, I guess. Look at how this looks. Hey, what the fuck? Isn't that sick? Wait, where'd we get the cocaine from? Yeah, I saw cocaine in there, bro. You see that? Isn't that fucking crazy? Ooh. I don't, I don't know what that is yet. Because Auto's was... back around. Auto likes cocaine. Yeah, Auto used to give us a shit ton of cocaine. What does coke do for you? Ah, it's just fucking amazing, brother. 
like, like better than meth, you know? You're just sniffing, like fucking, you know what I mean? Like, think about it, like, it's like, it's like meth, essentially, but like, a lot better. Oh. Alright, brother. You're mostly caught up at this point. At this I point am. forward, don't talk about this to anyone. I won't. You know, be... Obviously, like, some of the nerds know a lot of shit. So if we see those pussies on the street, should we go clap them or why? No. We're avoiding... Gun uh, We're taking your car or my car? We'll take my car. Alright. You wanna just do some boosting, right? Yeah. I got a friend I kinda wanna bring along. His name's Buck. Mind if I tag Ooh. him in? Uh, who is this guy? I also wanna introduce you to someone, by the way, that's going to be very useful for our future endeavors. Should we go meet them now or... Later. Uh, his name is Jesse. Let's just say he is incredibly good with a with a firearm. Does he cook? Cook what? <laughs> Meth. <laughs> oh, very funny actually. <laughs> anyway, uh, but 